This game is called Bugs, Bunnies, Beanbag, Bonanza. Try saying that five times fast. Yeah. Watch out, Doc. First, you're going to need a whole bunch of hula hoops spread out within your playing area. Notice that I have two yellow hula hoops and two blue hula hoops. That's going to be real important. Next, spread out a whole bunch of bean bags and fluff balls like I have done here. Then split your class into two teams, a yellow team and a blue team. Okay, the first thing that your kids need to know is that they have to be in a hula hoop at all times. They can move around the playing area, but they have to do it by jumping from hula hoop to hula hoop, which is why it's called Bugs Bunny's Beanbag Bonanza. If they do step out, they're out of the game for the rest of the round. Each round is about one minute. All right, like I said, there's a yellow team and a blue team. The yellow team's goal is to get as many of these bean bags or fluff balls or whatever you have into the yellow hula hoops, either one of them. The blue team's goal is to get as many items into the blue hula hoops as they can. As they're jumping from hoop to hoop within the playing area, they're going to pick up one item at a time, only one at a time, toss it into their hula hoop, and then every time you throw something, you have to move hula hoops. So I can't pick something up and throw it and pick something else up and throw it. I've got to throw, move, throw, move, constantly moving. Now they are allowed to steal in this game. So if I was on the blue team, I could jump into the yellow hula hoop, I could pick something up, and I could try to toss it into my team's hula hoop. But remember, every time I throw something, I have to move. So I can't just stand here throwing stuff out. I throw one, I move somewhere else, I pick something up, I throw it. There's also a five second time limit in each hula hoop. Now I'm not gonna sit there and count how long each kid's in the hula hoop, but if I see a kid standing too long in a hoop, I'm gonna say, hey, five, four, three, two, one. If they don't move, then they're gonna be out for the rest of the round. The reason for that is kids will go to their team's hula hoop otherwise, and they'll stand there forever and just block bean bags as they're being thrown. At the end of the game, count how many bean bags are in the two yellow hula hoops, count how many bean bags are in the two blue hula hoops, and then whoever has the most is the winner. Guys, until next time, play hard and make a difference.